Hey, out here tonight with uh, Trey Rust, and we're uh, he got him a dog, older male, well, yeah, four year old male, four or five year old male, tricolor. He'd never seen him run. There's the rabbit, you see it? Two, Two of them. Two of them. Uh, he, uh, so, anyhow, he's out here to see what kind of a dog he got. And uh, that's him. That's him. He's out in front of them right now. Well, I think there was another one up there around the turn. Yeah, there's two. I saw the two. So, well, he went back to them. So, the trouble is they can't trail it across this dirt. He did. He hit it. There they come. He did good. He's out. You see, and and that's I, that doesn't surprise me. But see, that's the difference in my dogs. Notice how they had the line and they stayed with the rabbit. Yes, sir. And and he will be quicker. And at times, now that I've seen a little bit of him, he'll look like he's controlling the race. I mean, he'll look like he's the because mine are uh, real tight line control kind of dogs. Now they will pick the pace. I mean, this isn't a bad pace they're running this rabbit. I mean, they moved it. And the only thing you got to worry about, you know, we saw two rabbits, and they're obviously running the one that was farthest away from us. But what you're in risk of right here is a split, you know, where uh, part of the pack stays with one and the other of them, you know. Mine, you know, should stay together, but. You never know. Hear that one right there? Now, she's got the rabbit. I mean, oh, God. when she's... But these rabbits, uh, I was hoping it's gonna be a little better since we had that rain this morning. Uh, these rabbits the last two or three times out here have been making them work pretty hard. Really? Stay with them. So, in the vernacular of the beagle business, I'm gonna turn this off. There he is. And that's, that's surprising the dog out of me. He's not, there he is actually, I'm sorry. Now they're looking. They got it out here in this deep stuff. That's a little female I was telling you about. That's the little female picked it up again. See, she's solid as a rock, but she'll she'll let them get away from her a little bit. You solo her, she would just, just run it like that all day. She's not one of my pack dogs, my competition dogs. But to me, her kind of problem is an inherited problem. She she throws some good looking pups. And, I bet you, if they keep moving to where it goes, it's gonna cross this path, the deal. Well, they're not showing you their 
She's still running that rabbit over there. You might want to get out on the path and you can watch them. I'm going to step back here and see if I can get her. I'll be back to you in just a minute. They'll probably go into those cross and go into those woods. That's only about 40, 50 feet across there, but like I told you, he's a little bit quicker. So see, he's moved away from him. And that's okay. He needs to be quicker. It's just, does he keep the race, you know? Mm -hmm. They don't trust him. They don't know whether to go to him or not. But this is the style of dog you got to have if you're going to win the kind of competition I run in. They got to stay on it like this. They can't be out like him losing and yeah, looking for it. They got to stay back here. And, and now, on a good scent day, he's going to look like a million bucks. No, because he he can lock on and stay on it. It's just when it's tough like this, like right now, 